Hi, this is Matt Crawford, and this is a quick, straightforward video on how to share a Notion page. So, say you have a Notion page, I've got my brand kit page open up here. So you want to actually share your Notion page with other people, whether that's publicly or just to uh, select people. Uh, this video will actually show you how to do all of those things. So, we've got this page open, this is just a simple page to actually highlight some font ideas, uh, different design uh, hex codes and stuff for different colours. Um, I just clicked on Ask AI there by mistake. So yeah, I've, it's just a basic page, okay? so. Uh, we're going to come up in order to share so you have the page open and you want to come up to the top here to the right and we're going to click on share and once you've clicked on share you've got these options here so we've got share and publish so if you want to actually publish to the web which you can now do with notion uh, you will so share by default you will come across to publish and all you need to do is click this publish button right here and now that would actually give us a a link here so we can obviously copy this uh, this link we can select some options here as far as search engine indexing goes so essentially Google might actually pick up this page probably quite unlikely because it's kind of an, an unusual uh, URL as you can see here but we can actually view the site and this is essentially publicly available we can click this one here to actually copy the site link and we can share that with other people as you can see it's actually copied to the clipboard here and we, we've got a few other options here so we can actually unpublish as well we can view the site I'm actually going to unpublish here just for a minute uh, just for the purposes of this video so if we go back to the be to well the beginning here the uh, kind of default here is to share so I can actually share this with an individual so we've got these options here so for general access to this particular page and I should probably add here that this is only sharing this page so when we click this share button in the top right here we're only sharing this page we're not kind of sharing our whole entire uh, notion and you know all of our super secret documents and all this kind of stuff you know we're just actually sharing this one page so uh, for the general access we've got these options so we can share with just people that we invite so this will be through uh, like it says here email or group uh, separated by commas uh, we could also select this option here which is anyone at Matt's Notion with the link so this will be workspace members uh, I can actually directly give them the link and just share that with them straight away if they didn't already have access and then this one is everyone at Matt's Notion so essentially this makes uh, this particular page available to any members any team members who didn't ordinarily have access to this page so if it's a newly created page and you just happen to want to share it with your team members these are the options that you're going to use. So I'm going to just show you this one uh, for now, just go through the process of actually inviting people. So we've got that one selected and then we're going to actually select the email here. So we're just going to uh, put the email in here and we're gonna click invite and that will actually invite that person. They'll get an email, uh, they just click through uh, the, uh, the email um, the link that they get in the email and they go straight through to here and they actually have access to in this case the brand kit page or whichever page you're actually sharing so hopefully uh i'm just going to take this off uh that was dash lane uh yeah so hopefully this has been a super simple straightforward way to actually share your notion documents your notion pages with other people whether that's team members or people external that aren't actually team members currently on your notion Hopefully this has been helpful. I've been Matt Crawford.